Hey guys, it's time to unbox the new Huawei P10 Lite. I have it in sapphire blue color and I actually got mine like a month ago and I didn't make any video about it because I was so busy with the Galaxy S8 and the S8 Plus but uh, yeah, now it is available in the local stores. You can get it. It costs around $300, $300 something, $30,000 plus price so yeah let's get right into it okay removing the plastic here real quick there we go Huawei P10 Lite nice packaging as always you can see they have launched 4 GB RAM model uh, officially here not the 3 GB RAM model that is great and also had 32 gigs of internal memory and the option to expand it via micro SD card slot so that is nice so we got two small seals here let me just quickly cut them there we go Let's take this one out just like that wow nice 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 packaging and here we have the phone itself in the sapphire blue color we will be comparing it to the black color that I have wow this is looking so beautiful inside this plastic but let's take a look at some other contents so we have this little thing which includes stuff like charger I guess yeah, we have the charger, so, and also we have the cable for charging the phone. This is the normal USB cable, not the type C, and we have normal uh, ear pods or headphones. So this is a fast charger. As you can see, it says Huawei Quick Charge, which means that Huawei P10 Lite has fast charging. That is good news. And uh, let's see the phone itself, the star of the show. So as you can see, it is looking really beautiful. Let's remove the plastic here. Wow. Oh my God, this is such a good looking phone. And so premium as well. I mean, this time they there is no plastic like they've done with the P9 Lite. I mean, it's really, really good. I'm glad that there's no home button. I never really liked it on the P10 and the P10 Plus. I like it on the back, the fingerprint scanner, so, oops. Wow, it is so reflective. I have to say this is like my second favorite uh, looking phone from Huawei after Honor 8. I mean, this is super, super sexy. Uh, you can see we have 3.5 millimeter headphone jack on the top, on the bottom, the charging port, the speaker, the SIM card tray on the left, the power and the volume rocker on the right. So let's just quickly fire this one up and take a look at the phone phone's display which is by the way 1080p i think it's 5.2 inch um also the battery size is 3000 milliamp hours a bit less than the huawei p10 and uh, we also get a 12 megapixel camera on the back uh, so it can record videos up to 1080p not 4k that's okay uh, and on the front we have 8 megapixel camera that should be improved uh, compared to the last year. We also have the another box which includes the Huawei P10 Lite quick start guide so you can read this to know more about your newly uh, bought phone and of course we have the silicone case, silicone plastic case, uh, just a normal case and uh, love for their customer Huawei, very nice thing that you include the case with the box and also of course we do get the um, protector for the display in order to protect it and also we do have Android 7.0 Nougat uh, running so it should be having that latest EMUI skin look so it is on and we're gonna go through the setup English United States next skip set as a new phone okay I'm just gonna quickly enroll the fingerprint scanner just to see um, the speed and you know how much fast it is because the fingerprint scanner on the P10 and the P10 Plus uh, is really, really fast, blazingly fast. So get started. All right. Um, Skin-wise, of course, I mean, it's the same as their flagship phone. As you can see, uh, the change uh, notification, I mean, the cook setting area. The overall look is the same as before. So I'm just going to quickly go into settings and show you guys here in the about phone section that it is Android 7.0 Nougat. And this is a 1080p display. If we check out down here, yes, it is 1080p. So uh, we have 32 gigs of internal memory. And out of that, we have 
uh, 20 gigabyte free. And we have Kirin 658 processor. That is a new chip. Uh, I would love to see its performance against some of the top uh, phones we have. And 4 gigs of RAM, which I believe should be more than enough to have a good, amazing RAM management. Let's check out the camera. And as you can see, we have the changed UI. So lots of lots of mode, HDR, um, time lapse, pro video, pro photo, slow motion video. That is nice. That's also there. And then, of course, we have a bunch of different options here. I think it's the same camera as the Huawei Honor 8 Lite. Uh, so you can control the exposure. Let's see the options. And as you can see, full HD 1080p, 30 frames per second. A quick comparison with the black Huawei P10 Lite side by side. So again, uh, just like their big top phones, uh, the black color does not reflect that much. It just looks like a normal color. But the blue one here, the Sapphire Blue and the Dazzling Blue on the P10, they look super, super good and super reflective. So same thing here. Uh, I would definitely recommend you to go with the, I mean, if you want the fancy color, then go with the with the blue one. It looks so good. Uh, but uh, if you just want the normal look and you just love black color uh, like me, then go with the black one. I'm actually using uh, Midnight Black Galaxy SA Plus, so I have a uh, really soft corner for this black color. But uh, yeah, uh, quick unboxing of the Huawei P10 Lite. Uh, let me know what videos you want to see. I will be doing a full review of this phone pretty soon. And uh, yeah, see you guys in the next one. Peace.